Oh, hello, everybody. Hello. Where were you when the world stopped turning? That is what we were talking about today. Today is 9-11. You'll probably see this mm -hmm. a few days after 9-11. Probably a lot of days after 9-11. Where were you? We're leaving. I was in beauty school. I was on my way to beauty school when I started hearing things on the radio, and I was like, what? Because when I heard it on the radio, it was just a plane hit into a building, and that's all that was on the radio. And so I was like, oh, that's crazy. Like, I was already crying just because that is so sad. Like, even if it was just a total accident, it's just so sad. And then when I got to school, all the TVs were on. Everyone was just, like, huddled around the TVs, and everyone was crying. There was, like, there was a couple girls that had husbands in the army that were just sobbing because they knew what that meant, like... Um, yeah, it was really, really hard. We didn't get any work done. We had the news on all day. We just pretty much canceled classes. We were only there till like lunch. And then they were just like, everyone just go home. Because this is not productive. What was that? The heck? Oh. What? The thing that connects to the... So I'm talking the and then something just pops off the wall and lands on the ground. That was a ghost. Yeah, it was a ghost. I... I was attending Utah Valley State College. I was enrolled in one class, country dance class. Probably put a damper on things, didn't it? Well, I showed up to class and I didn't understand the gravity or, you know, just how serious it was. I was like, okay, yeah, something happened, whatever. Everyone was staring at TVs. I was like, okay, let's get on with it, move on. I didn't really understand how serious it was. You didn't care? No, I, I didn't. Well, I didn't really look into it. I saw I saw some people watching TVs, but then then I then I looked at it again. And I kind of saw how serious it was, and everybody just was. As soon as you see the footage, it just stopped. Because it, well, cause I didn't really look at it at first, but then I was no, like, oh crap, this is big. That's not an accident. Yeah, yeah, that's how I felt too. Like in the car, I was just like, oh, I like how did that happen? And then I got to school and I looked at the TV and I was just like, this was not an accident. And it's, it was like, felt like it was yesterday. Yeah. It's weird that it's 13 years like, ago. I, like that, that's what hit me the biggest today. Like, like the hardest today. I was just like, no, A, I'm not that old. B, that is, it's like, that's how well I remember it. It was yesterday. Like I remember how I felt like what I was wearing, like everything just but now it's less like, it's a history lesson now, like, Zayd, he's eight years old. He was, he was just like, what? He wasn't even born, like, it's just like, this thing, the same as anything uh, yeah, else they learn in history, it's just some... I will never forget, and it's horrible, it's horrifying. On, like, this anniversary, and today, like, every September 11th now, I'm just like, on edge, and my heart is just heavy. And I am terrified, like last, or was it last year or two years ago when Benghazi happened, like on 9-11? Yeah. It's just, like when that happened, it's the same thing. I was just like, no, not again. And so, yeah. yeah. And now, I mean, yeah, the terrorists, they plan things, like things are get way crazy in the Middle East right now. Who knows? I mean, I don't think nothing big happened today, but we're just worried that something else is going to happen. That we know but of, yeah. Just, I guess they still have a couple hours. Better not happen. But you can't live your life in fear. You just gotta love those that are close to you and live each day and just be nice to people and remember those that have died in Best service of our country. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. So uh, that's our vlog today. That's it. Sorry it's not funny. It's kind of a sad day, but we had... But that's kind of how we felt today. We weren't in a really funny mood. It was... Like I said, I'm really, like, every anniversary, I just, like, it's like we're mourning all over again. Just so much sadness and so much terror and horrible. And But then, like, I hear on the radio, like, the, about the heroes, and it's, that's, like, so inspiring to me. The people that, the Let's Roll guy. I can't remember his name, but I can remember Let's Roll. That's his line. Anyway, um... Tomorrow is my niece's wedding, Monica. You guys saw her bridal shower and her, I guess she's been on the vlog a couple times with baby Daxton camping. Mm -hmm. So they're getting married tomorrow, I'm excited about that. And Davey and I are gonna be doing pictures and videos, but our kids are all gonna be there. And so the family's gonna have to just pick up the slack with the kids since we're gonna be kind of working. 
So we'll see how that works. But and then the next day we are going to Lake Powell. And there's no inter internet. I cannot talk. I'm so tired. And there's no internet. I can't do it. <laughs> so tired. I'll finish. Okay. There's no internet in Lake Powell, so hopefully we're a few days behind on our vlog, so hopefully it makes it, and then after Lake Powell we're going to Cancun. There's internet in Cancun, so we'll, we'll be able nice to upload videos. Out. But while we're in Cancun, you're probably going to be seeing the Lake Powell videos. Anyways, oh, oh also oh, good go. news today, the house we're building, it, they finished the road. They just finished the road, which means really nothing because... We still don't have permits. We still don't have dig dates. But it's we something. Still... It's progress. It It's something. Now we can't say the road's still not finished, I guess. The road is done. They're digging yeah. next. Progress. So we're excited So there's for one that. step closer, and that is we drove on the road today. We should have vlogged exciting. it. Sorry. We'll vlog it, was... it another day. I yeah. felt like Mater when he's like, I'm the first one to drive on the new road. That's how I felt. She did. I didn't say that, but she I didn't felt say it. That, but I know how you felt when you yeah, did it. it was that's, really fun. I wish I had felt like Mater during it. You should have told me. Do you even know what line I'm talking about? Yeah, when he first paves the road. It's all. <laughs> 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 say good, good night, night everybody. everybody. <laughs>